Hey, good morning there. Was Tractor Man 44 here. I think I told you in the last video, or, or one very recent video, the basic difference between a long way and a short way radius. I think that was in the video where I made the long way radius. Today we're going to make a short way radius. Actually, it's going to be one. It's one step better than that. It's going to be a. It's going to be a short way reducing radius. Actually, in the direction of travel, it's going to be going in eight inches and out ten inches. Uh, Got to get a rough idea of what it is that you want to do. So I'm envisioning a radius that goes like this right here. So I've got a six inch throat on one, so I'm going to come up from here. Actually, I'm going to mark a one inch line down here for the S and drive. Off of that full raw edge, I'm going to come up six inches because this side has a six inch throat on it. So I'm going to go up six inches and then to allow for the quarter inch bend over there, I'm going to drop down to five and three quarter and give us another mark. This is going to have a four inch throat this way, so we're going to come in four inches and go back out of there three inches to give us the one inch mark there and also take a quarter of an inch off of that for the radius right here. So if that's the case we've got four inch right here, there's four inch down here, quarter of an inch off of that, that's going to be our inside wrapper. It's going to increase to ten inches down here so I know off of this quarter inch line which is the four inch mark I'm going to add ten inches to it and we're going to add a quarter of an inch to that which should give us 14 and a quarter up here at the top, minus the quarter, and off of this line here, the inside line right there, we mark up 8 inches because it's reducing, or reducing from 10 to 8 inches, and then we add a quarter to it. Go ahead and mark our 1 inch drive for the drives. So here's our 10. We're going to establish this. And establish this. So now all we have to do is come up here and get us the minimum dimension to make sure we have at least nine inches across there. So we go something like that right there. We can see we're going to have to have roughly ten inches up and roughly nine inches in. Connect these dots. Add the quarter inch to it. There's our fitting. Eight inch in a radius ten inch. Here's our pattern. We'll lay out another one here, upside down, or inverted.
So here you are guys, uh, pretty much a vanilla flavored short way reducing radius, 10 by 20 reducing to 8 by 20 with a uh, 6 inch throat and a 4 inch throat. Pretty simple, uh, pretty straightforward, uh, no turning vanes required, this return air, and that's pretty much all there are to it. Here's a classic example of a long way and a short ra radius in combination doing this thing to change the direction of airflow. You can see it entering vertically here with a 20 inch dimension vertically, going in, going upwards, turning and delivering the horizontal horizontally the 20 inch dimension. So this long way going into the short way doing this thing to change direction. You will see this show up on a project I'm working on but not in this configuration. There's going to be a, a few additions in between these guys. So you know what this is Trackman 44 and I'm out of here guys. <laughs>